Hey guys, welcome back. So today I have my favorites and finds. And if you're new to my channel, it's basically where I combine my monthly favorites with a few things that I've recently picked up. So we're gonna go ahead and jump into it. Oh, by the way, I also got something super exciting in the mail and I have to share with you guys. So it is the new Urban Decay Naked Heat Palette. So at the end of the video, if you guys wanna take a, a look at it um, and do some swatches and all that, cause I haven't even swatched it, you guys. I'm so excited though. Um, so yeah, I'll do that at the end of the video. But for now, we're gonna go ahead and jump into my favorites. You know what? I'm I'm gonna start off with accessories just to kind of, oh, I had this on backwards. So my first thing I wanna share with you guys is this necklace. It is so gorgeous. It's one of those like layered necklaces. It's really dainty, really pretty. But what I like about this one is that they made it a little bit thicker so it doesn't get as tangled as easily. It doesn't get tangled as easily. Do you guys know what I'm talking about? Like um, this is from Bobble Bar, by the way. I also have these really cute rings that I wanna share with you. I showed them to you guys on Snapchat and Instagram. If you guys are not following me on social media, you definitely should because I post their stuff that I don't post on my channel sometimes. Uh, but these are the rings and they're absolutely beautiful. They are by HRH Collection and they're like, I think they're called Privé Collection. Uh, they're absolutely gorgeous though. They're so unique. This was supposed to be like a midi ring, but I think I ordered a size too big I ordered size six and I probably should have ordered size five so I just kind of wear it a little bit like down like that uh, but you can adjust it a little bit like it's not super super flimsy but it's flexible enough to where you can adjust it if you have smaller fingers uh, but this one is probably my favorite it's so unique it has a pill on one side and then a heart on the other side and it's just like really quirky. And the last thing are these earrings. I have these in, in this gold color and then I also have them in rose gold. I honestly can't decide which one I love more but I've been really enjoying this style of like the stacked beads. So gorgeous and you guys are gonna probably guess where they're from. So I saw this at HEB, it's the Dove Shower Foam. They have it in this one. They also have the cucumber scent, which I like that one, but I personally prefer the original Dove scent. It's just like very nostalgic for me because I grew up with my mom using this, so she always smelled like it. And Dove like has that scent that lingers forever and ever. Um, but this stuff is so, <laughs> I know it's gonna sound weird, but like it's fun to use a shower, a body wash, but um, it is like it comes out super, super foamy. And then you put it on your like loofah and it foams up even more which is crazy and it just you feel like really clean and fresh when you come out of the shower okay so next I have this uh, coconut miracle oil body mist you only need such a tiny bit of it because a little bit goes a long way but this is a body oil mist and you just spray it on your body and you can either rub it in or just kind of let it sink into your skin it smells really really nice and it's nice hydration for the summertime for someone that has dry skin like me because it's not like super dry like it is in the winter months uh, but I just love it and it's really really lightly scented like coconut it's not overpowering or anything like that and it just makes me feel like super <laughs> this is sound weird but it makes me feel like super luxurious when I'm putting it on because my skin just glistens and it looks so good okay so I have two makeup items that I want to share with you guys the first one is the one that I'm wearing in the center of my lip and this is a lip topper from Jouer in the color tan lines it's so pretty. I love wearing this with like a really nude lip. Well, actually the way I'm wearing it. So I'm wearing a Too Faced Cool Girl. And then I just put this in the center and it just makes it pop. Like it makes it almost like 3D. And not only that, you guys, but this stuff smells amazing. It smells like cupcakes. And I don't know how many times I'm gonna say that, but oh, it just smells so good. I went to Neiman Marcus. I go to Neiman Marcus like once a year. I'm not even joking. And I go there specifically for this my Tom Ford eyeliner. This is my favorite eyeliner in the entire world. I was introduced to it about three years ago and ever since I've been repurchasing it every time I run out, which is only once a year. And you guys know I wear eyeliner all the time, which I'm not wearing it right now because I wanted to keep it in the package to show you guys. So yeah, I went to the Tom Ford counter and this is what the eyeliner looks like. It is, I th I'm sure I've talked about this on my channel before. It has two ends. It has one tiny little point that is felt tip and then it has a longer point that is a brush. And I honestly, I love both sides. I, I use both sides equally. Uh, this is just like the most foolproof eyeliner. I can literally do my eyeliner in the car as my husband's driving because it's just so easy to use. Um, so yeah, I went and picked this up at Neiman Marcus and while I was there, I kind of was looking around, I saw some of their summer collection and I picked something up. This is so weird. They had like four different colors, but I was automatically drawn to this one. You open it up and it's got 
the wet pigment on the bottom, which is basically just cream eyeshadow. And then you pop the top open and it's got um, bronze colored glitter and then it also has a little mirror on there. So it's actually using it right now, Let's see. And this is just, I mean, honestly, I was talking to the sales lady and was telling her, like I was just hypnotized by all the glitter. Like I was watching all the glitter. I swear nobody does glitter like Tom Ford, you guys. Like it's just so, it's like microscopic, pretty, like not over the top obnoxious. But yeah, if you're looking to treat yourself for the summertime and just like have that like one lid color, if you're not like huge into makeup, you know, go check out these pigments. They have other colors. They had like a rose gold color. They also had like a gold color. How cute are these? Oh my gosh. So they are little containers that you can refill with whatever you want. Like they come empty and they have a little cork top and they have a little spoon on them. So I got these from my coffee station and this one has cinnamon in it and this one has cocoa powder. So I always put cinnamon in my coffee. Well, not always, most of the time. And recently I started adding cocoa powder and they were like two bucks, like 250 or something like that. So I'm also giving our patio a little, a, like a mini facelift, which I am gonna have a video for you guys either probably this coming Sunday and show you guys like how we redid the backyard. So I bought a few accessories to spruce it up and I bought these pillows. I got them off of Wayfair. I'll see if I can find the link for you guys. So I got two of these and I just fell in love with the print. And then I also got this one right here, which is just so stinking cute. It's just like all white and then it's got like a little bicycle with flowers on it. And I just thought this was simply adorable. So this is gonna be for our swing, um, our little like patio swing, and then the other two, um, and then these are gonna be alternating with all cream pillows. Um, but yeah, I'm really, really excited to set everything up. I think it's gonna look so pretty. We also got some new uh, topiary. I, can someone tell me if I'm saying this right? Cause I, I just saw it right now, but it's T-O-P-I-A. R-Y topiary. Got them off of Wayfair too. I've been looking for the perfect ones forever and I would always check home goods, but they just haven't had like a really good selection lately. So I went on Wayfair and I found these and they have so many guys. Like it was so hard to pick the ones that I picked. Um, but I ended up going with these because the size was really good. I wanted something really tall. Okay, so last thing I want to share with you guys that I recently got is this area rug for my office. So I got this gorgeous white fluffy soft rug. So this was actually a gift from this company called Wolf. Woven. They're also offering you guys a really good discount and you guys this rug is such a good price It's like home goods prices. I will find the code and leave it down below for you guys So check it out if you are interested in a rug like this. All right guys So now let's take a look at the Urban Decay collection. I'm so excited. You guys don't understand I've been dying to swatch this. I already opened the palette because I did do like a little mini um, boomerang on Instagram and I opened it so you guys could see it but look how pretty got warm browns and plums. The cover is like a hard shell material and then the letters are kind of raised a little bit. It's plastic. Uh, it does have like the magnetic shut. First, I kind of just want to play with the colors a little bit. So I'm gonna go ahead and insert some swatches for you guys right here. So that's everything I have to share with you guys. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. And, oh, there's something stuck on my ring. It's fur. If you're new, also subscribe. I upload videos every single week and I do lifestyle and also beauty and fashion. So I'm gonna let you guys go and I'll talk to you guys next time. Mwah. Bye.